Hey, what's going on, everybody? Um, welcome uh, to a video. I haven't done a video in a long time. Um, very tired, <laughs> ready to go to bed. But um, I was laying here um, in bed, and I was, uh, you know, some things were just some. <clears throat> excuse me. Some things were just popping to my mind, and um, it just kind of thought just kind of hit me. You know, some things that's happened you know in the past and uh I just, I just think about you know this thought just popped in my mind how does it feel for the one that you love to hurt you all right just think about that how does it feel for the one that you love your spouse you know your your partner or or, or even your fiance or your girlfriend boyfriend whomever whomever you're dating or whomever you're with, just think about it. How does it feel when the one you love that hurts you? It doesn't feel good because you love them, right? It doesn't feel good because you have feelings towards them. It doesn't feel good because you're affectionate towards that person. It, it really, when someone loves someone, it, I mean, they can... Someone can get hurt, you know, from their mom, their dad, their sibling, their friend. But when they have strong feelings and actual love for someone, that hurts them a whole lot more than what all these other people that might hurt them. Because they love them. And I think about that because this is the point that I'm getting to. It's really just thinking twice before you gotta excuse my camera like my phone is like you know it's been dropped like 49 times and this my flashlight don't even work anymore my camera don't even work somehow my, my you know video recording is working but anyway but the point that i'm getting to is really just thinking twice before you say something because you think about it how you was hurt when that other person was mad at you or whether they said something to you or just whenever whenever a boyfriend and girlfriend are not talking because someone says something that they're, they're really hurt actually they're really hurt by that person because they're hurt deeply because they love that person and so like i said the point i'm getting to is in so many different words it's just really just think twice you know how you felt when they hurt you so if you get mad or they you know attend, you know they they said something or, you know, and you really just want to go off, just, you know, think twice. You know, the Bible does say, and I was thinking about this scripture um, before I get on here, really, it speaks in James, be um, quick to listen, slow to speak, slow to wrath. Because you might actually hurt them, it doesn't matter, depending on what they've done, you, you can actually really hurt that person that you love, your marriage, boyfriend girlfriend and you can also take it to even a even a brother or a sibling you know or your mom your dad your friend you know because you remember the feeling that you felt whenever they got mad at you whenever they quit talking to you whether the things they said to you that would just seem like they shouldn't have been said you you felt that feeling excuse me i'm falling asleep but think about that and just like look i just I remember that feeling. I'm not going to say nothing back to them because I don't want to hurt them because I love them. So when you really, you know, oh, the scripture, Corinthians, love is patient. Love is kind. And, and it goes down. It goes on. But love is patient. Love is kind. Love endures all things. You know? That's it. Praise God. God bless. Sleep well. Enjoy your vanilla ice cream.